I have something to show you. Follow me, follow me. Just come, come, come. Look at this, look at this. So we have a thing in our team that we're playing answers. Look at this. Wait, wait, wait. Look. Look who's on the first place. It's Sense and it's JCAM and it's Stiko. Mm -hmm. I'm the best. This this work this on? Tell me what day it is, Martin. Yeah? What day is it? Friday 16th. Final day of the bootcamp for RMR qualifier for the major. First CS2 major. Doing good? Last couple of tracks before we head into Romania. Hi, my name is Mia Stelberg and I'm a sports psychologist. Uh, I've been working as a sports psychologist now for 20 years and uh, in the esports scene I've worked with lots of different teams and um, I have a lot of experience in this environment. So far I've worked very shortly with Apex, so the first months are always about getting to know people and for the people as well to, to get to know me and understanding where the strengths and weaknesses are so we can start focusing on them. Well, obviously we've done a lot of preparations, but in my opinion, we should always have good preparations no matter where we are going. So consistency is very important for the teams. But yeah, for this specific event, we've done a lot of boot camping. We've obviously done a lot of hours uh, practicing, but we've also spent some time on the mental side of the game because we all know that the mental factors are huge and significant and they need to be practiced as well. It has been a very wonderful organization and I've enjoyed to, to get to know everyone. It's a very good vibe, mood. People do really care for each other as well. So that is something I do appreciate. We've had some changes, you know, new players coming in. So we are very still early on, on getting to know each other. But so far I liked everything that I've seen. It's evening. Last day, we are uh, finished with the practice and the preparation. We're flying tomorrow early, so I'm getting my stuff ready, packing into this. Make sure that you don't forget anything because that would be a fucking bummer. It's time to uh, qualify for the major and see you tomorrow because we are traveling, so be with us there. Bye bye! <laughs> Morning, travel day. Touchdown, Godmon. Touchdown, touchdown at the airport. Sicker, but do you care how it is going? Sicker, but do you care how it is going? No. Aha, my friend. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Romania. Yeah. <laughs> right now we're in uh, Bucharest. Just arrived. We go to the hotel. Look at the pack room, and then chill. It's gonna be nice. <laughs> oh, cool. The desk guy is like very nice. Very nice pizza. I mean, a very nice tip. <laughs> Everyone is asleep. Yes. Good night. And what day is it tomorrow? Sunday. Monday. <laughs> Good night. Good night. Media. Today. Tomorrow. Oh. Good morning. Rate to sleep from one to ten, uh, Tata. Actually, I would rate nine. The bed nine? was yes. The bed was very comfy because I have solo room, you know, and I have big bed, and I was a little bit tired. So when I went to the bed. And I had like maybe eight and a half hours of sleep. I am feeling very refreshed right now. Yo boys, first day here in Bucharest. Uh, as you can see around, we're just in the crack room chilling at the moment. Today we have media day. We got one or two scrims lined up. Hopefully it will be possible to play. A little bit of loss, you know, have caused some issues, but we'll see. So just follow us through the day. Nice, Snooper. Fucking Snooper. It was fucking smooth. The first take as well. 
That was not a good take. He was like, uh, so I come here, boys. It's me. <laughs> Why is our manager never a uh, guy of the day? Huh? Why? Actually, that's true. That's yeah. fucking true. Can't I think our fans would love to no, see some. Uh, to speak with the, the media guys, not me. I will talk to media guys, <laughs> and I will make them make a star we'll of the day. Force them. Rizzo tried to make an outro yesterday. Didn't work. Not like. Everyone is sleeping. <laughs> what day is it tomorrow? Uh, Sunday. No, media day. Okay, good night. Good night. Alright boys, let's get it started. Let's get Turn around started. please. Yeah, baby. Yeah. Pull, pull. Yeah. I also had a joke today. Well, I heard a joke. The climate change. You know why? How we know? There's so many whales on, on the land. But this whale is still alive. <laughs> It's a bit uh, too much strange things. Come on, relax. Yeah. When you eat like that, you don't get a flu, you stay healthy. You have good cholesterol, your blood sugar stays low. Um, you can focus better. <coughs> This group, and for me, if I'm speaking from my own feelings or whatever, mm. I think if we don't try to over prep it, it will benefit us more. If we try to, you know, be the most prepared team in the world and we know where every player is at every time and every step he makes, we will forget about ourselves and only focus on them, and then I think we will be in trouble. I'm not saying we should not prepare, but. Yeah. But like yeah. the balance between this the looseness, the but then having structure. Yeah, yeah so for me, like, because I'm trying to learn and observe like what is the best environment for everyone and I feel that right now the vibe is good and people are feeling good. How are you feeling about like Odne? Is he taking more of his place? Because we also spoke about last time about the dynamic change, him being an IGL, what you can do for him to support him. Like how do you feel that's going? I mean I think me and Odne, I can only speak for myself though, but I think uh, on a personal level we have been getting close, you know. We're always sharing room together, having a lot of fun together. Yeah. You know, like we are, of course, both Norwegian, it helps. It's easier yeah. with communication, all that stuff. But I think, you know, our bond, I guess, yeah. is pretty strong. Mm -hmm. uh, and I think from his POV, like if I think at him in the group, he's taking more and more space. And in the beginning, he was yeah. maybe a little bit passive, you know? Mm -hmm. He's becoming more himself, you know? Exactly. Yeah, yeah. Push it. Uh, we have some info from Elliot on this map. table in the world and we um, are about to get some food 
So day one in Bucharest is over. Uh, media day, I guess it's called. We have done a little bit of practice as well and game plan. You know, being ready for tomorrow. Tomorrow, first day versus first game, sorry, versus OG at three o'clock. Um, best of one, anything can happen. But definitely having a good feeling going into it, and then uh, playing later on the night as well, even if you win or lose. And you know, keep following the vlog, daily uploads. You know. <laughs>